In this video, I'm going to show you a complete step-by-step -step guide on how to fix create cutout sticker not showing on Instagram. So if this is something that you want to be able to fix, well then this video is going to be perfect for you. Because me, myself, I had the exact same problem before, but I'm going to actually show you exactly how I myself was able to fix this issue quite quickly. So what you're going to do firstly is to actually close your Instagram app and close your Instagram app and instead you're going to go into your settings app on your phone. So open up your settings app and now you should be taking uh, to a page that is basically similar to what I have here. So you should be taken here basically. So now you're going to scroll down and find where it says general. So click on general and now you should be taken to this page right here. So on this page just scroll down in here until you can locate where it says storage. For me it says iPhone storage as you can see so click here. And by the way sometimes unfortunately on this specific page it can take a couple of seconds for it to completely load just so you know. And it depends on how much memory that you actually have used on your phone. But as you can see now it has actually loaded for me which is perfectly. Now what I'm going to do is just scroll down in here and click on Instagram as you can see. Now I'm just going to click on offload app, offload app once again. It's going to take a couple of seconds and then I'm going to click once again on the blue button here to get the Instagram app back. Because what will happen basically when you do exactly like this step by step is that you will automatically get a new update from Instagram to the latest version that is like right now basically and it will fix all the bugs that were in the previous version but it will also give you all the new features that, that is available for the newest update basically. So when you have done this then you can just wait for it to load. It can take a couple of seconds as well for it to load completely just so you know and now once again where it says upload app now as you can see that means that the app is now actually back on my Instagram or rather back on my phone of course. So I have now basically updated my Instagram app and you can go back and then hopefully this issue will be fixed for you.